Hello and welcome to Dover. We are in the 1987 Legends, NASCAR Legends, and getting ready to do some qualifying here. It is a late night race, 2.0K strength of field, and uh, we are the number one, unfortunately, as you can see. But hopefully uh, we'll have ourselves a fun one, despite the fact it is single split, I believe. It takes it's clear. Okay, Colton, we've got Ooh. two laps to set a decent time. Feeling okay for qualifying speed. I don't think I quite have pull speed necessarily, but give it to our best. We'll have one lap to do it, pretty much, as is often the case in this car. So let's uh, let's try to get it right the first time. Green, green, green. To the okay. line. Here comes your first time, yeah, Blast. Nice run. Bottom. Enough. Not going to be a full time, I don't think, unless the other guys kind of mess it up. Oh well, we're in the 24s, I guess that's okay. Three right now. Just done a 25 yeah, just overdrove it a little bit. Really trying to use that brake bias to get the car turned. Actually, my volume's a little low. I'm going to adjust that real quick. Volume just a little too low. It's fine, you got loads. I think it's fine. Okay. So, um... Number three of Jeff on the pole flag, right now. There's a name I don't see that I expect to probably jump us as well. So we could be P4 when the time comes. Chad's in here, we recognize from some of the league races. I wish him good luck. He has a good race. He has outqualified us. There's the name I expected to see. So yes, P4. That's just fine. We'll still have a, a second row starting spot. Not too bad. Uh, even if we end up <laughs> another row back, still fine. At least I didn't hit the wall. So we're gonna try this here. Green flag pit stop. No idea if we'll need to use it, but really try to learn this. Get, get it down. Because a uh, very, very difficult pit road to get on at Dover. Maybe one of the tougher ones. Um, I mean, that said, you can always, you know, just go really really slow and make it just fine but trying to be kind of fast at it very easy to spin very easy to speed and I've done both of those things before so just gotta watch out for that um, making sure I got everything right here yes break bias all the way back get as much rotation as we can the three interestingly on the pole but not ready to race sure what happened there they got they must have done that on their first lap i guess everybody got their fast lap on the first lap but they must have done that on their first lap and then hit the wall or spun or something the next time and uh have exited the vehicle and not pressed ready to race but it doesn't matter anyway got a handful of people that are uh, not quite ready that we're waiting on so that's fine. Both the two and three both had incident issues. Hey, at least we don't have to go to the backup car after qualifying. Not that that's a real thing, but, you know, we can pretend. So, getting under the 24s got us in the top four. Where that cut off, it looks like. I just barely snuck it into that time bracket. And uh, I guess we're just going to have to wait the full uh, extra 30 seconds or so. But, uh, of course, tire saving going to be important here, I think. It's going to be very important not to uh, get tight and slap the wall. Very easy to do in any car. I would even say especially in this car. So we're going to have to watch out for that for sure. Interestingly, Race Lab is saying if I finish fourth, I get one singular I rating <laughs> gained. 
So apparently I have to finish top four. That's the uh, end of the session. If I want to gain anything, I guess that's fine. <laughs> Man, tough crowd there at the eye reading calculation center. P4 is where we'll start though. Hopefully get a nice view of the leader. Hopefully have ourselves a clean, fun race. We don't have that data. My volume is still a little bit low on my end. I'm gonna put that up even more. We don't have the data. Okay, I think it's good now. Hundred laps, and how many tires? Two sets of tires. We're gonna be, have to be smart about using those too. They will make a big difference. So if uh, we start getting cautions at weird times, could be very interesting strategy situations. Possibly. And if you look, that's also interesting. 99.1 estimated laps of fuel. That's saying we can barely not make it. But that's pretty darn close. I think we probably could because we'll be saving later. I mean, I doubt this is very accurate anyway because we haven't run any laps yet. But that's very interesting. Very, very interesting. We need to follow we'll have to keep an eye on that, because if we can avoid pitting, lane. obviously we want to do that. Two wants to avoid using the throttle pedal. Okay, there we go. Did I have that muted? Okay. One left to green. Line up on the outside. Closed. Pit road is closed. We're going to save some fuel if we're going to be that close. Catch up two. Car. Don't think it's going to go all green, but like I said, I want to keep an eye on it. Looks like a first gear start, maybe? Eh, we'll do second gear. That felt a little uneasy. We'll find out if we regret that in a moment, but... I think second gear is probably the way to go. About to go green. Stay focused. Okay, Most car is off. Time to focus. do your job. Green, green, green. green, green. green. Car inside. Clear. The next car's the leader. Clear. Alright. Now we are going to ease our way around this track. They uh, seem like they're ready to go a little bit faster on the start the here. Three. That's totally cool with me. I'm going to be very easy, take this lowest line, just wrap the bottom, wait to get on throttle until I feel like I'm most of the way through the corner, use my brakes to rotate as much as I can, all that good stuff. The leader has just done a 25.6, the car in front has just done a 25.5. That feels good, keeping my wheel as straight as possible. Looks like I'm getting a good run out of the corner. Good lap, that's your quickest today. Quickest lap there, so... Maybe don't even need to push it quite that hard. Half a second behind is Chad. I'm sure he's saving as well. I could definitely see a caution happening and it being too early for tires. And then all that ground that those two gained is gone. But the tires remain the same. Could have us looking pretty good if that ends up happening. But if it wants to go green all the way, I will not be opposed to that either. Now we're definitely not making it on fuel. It has calibrated a little bit better. It's estimating we are most certainly not going to make it. Still very interesting how uh, 
Oh wow, yeah, it's, it's going. It, it's going down quick, so never mind. Not even really close, I don't think. So that was a false estimate, it would seem. We're actually catching these guys again, and I have not picked up my pace at all. Pit window is open. Yeah, that's very interesting. We didn't push at all, and uh, all of a sudden we're catching up on these guys. I'm telling you, the tire wear, how, how much it matters here, is just pretty absurd. The lap time was at 26.2. Just using that brake bias all the way back at 42%, using that to turn into the corner, basically not even turning the steering wheel at all. Run into the back of them all. I'm very careful about how I do this. Set up a run, maybe. Not right there. I don't want to do like a really crazy hard a high entry or anything to set up set it up because I feel like that'll undermine my tire saving uh, efforts because you like block in the middle lane. I'm trying to set something up here. Quite able to though. Just gonna wait for the right opportunity. Outside. Clear high. Sure, I'm actually outside. there. The next guy, yeah, the leader. That on. Clear outside. Okay. Whoa, I don't know why he's bump drafting me. That does not seem necessary. These cars don't quite like bump drafts. Not quite the ARCA car levels of it'll wreck you when you try it, but. They don't line up all too well. I prefer he would do that, but we're okay. We get around the two now. That was at twenty six point four. Man, I was like, great. Right now. Line up single file behind car number zero two. We're under caution. Gonna save it's some closed. fuel. You never know. Catch that two car. Someone on the front stretch still figuring it out, I guess. <sighs> Wish people would wait. Catch that two down the car. right there. It wasn't intentional. Well, so much for that strategy. Come off the wall and hit coming back down to you. Catch that too. What are these guys gonna do? I think it's too early to pit with two sets of tires. I don't know. I feel like we took care of them pretty well, so we're gonna stay out. Yeah. Okay, I think we're in a good position. I'm looking back there, I'm not seeing too many takers for the pit call. And I feel like we're in a really good spot with tires. So I'm feeling pretty good. 2.1 gallons. 2.1 estimated fuel needed right now. That is gallons. Save as much as we can. 19. Got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the outside. I 
I think we can probably make it to the end right now, now that we've had these pace laps, if it's estimating 2.1 gallons. have to do some more saving though I think Focus not sure we'll see what it says here in a moment two saving as well taking an even shorter way around by taking the apron and we're still just coming to two to go so we're saving a lot of fuel here One point nine gallons needed. I'm sure everybody's saving fuel. I imagine. That's how close we are. Trying to pass him here. Two, carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. You can save fuel really right. well in this car with how well it rolls. I've said that plenty of times before, but it's true. You can be on. You can be in uh, with the clutch in for forever, and it'll just keep going. There's probably some technical reasons for that that car people know that I don't. Nick, right, get ready. Get ready. Up on the at the end of this lap. Wait for the two to get into position. Seven gallons. 1.7 estimated now. We gotta catch up to them though. Because we're about to go green here soon. Got a lap car on the inside. It's interesting. I wonder if he, he might have fresh tires. That might make him faster than us. Be interesting to see what that looks like. Seems like there was a nice little handful of people caught in whatever that wreck was, though. Two is the control car, however. We'll be jumping whenever he is. Post car is off. Time to do your job. He's using uh, first gear start. Green, green, green. It works for him. It worked for him really well. For this guy not Clear pass me. I know he's got worse tires than we do. Inside. Clear. That lap time was 26.2. Using it around here. The tires cooled off, so that probably helped him out a little bit with grip. I think it should uh, come back to us a little bit here and show that that difference we had earlier. We're currently setting the pace. Higher wear. That's a new fastest lap for Brown, 25.3. He's got a little bit of a gap. He had a really good jump. Don't worry about too much. 
let it uh, get reeled in over time. Lots of race to go. And uh, going easy right now might help our fuel situation anyway. No reason we need to be at the front right now. 1.8 gallons. Point was a 26.0. Slowly closing in. Uh oh, I see smoke. Is there a wreck ahead? I don't see anyone on the relative. Whatever it was, they might have been able to get off track. Taking my time. End of this lap will be a quarter of the way through. Easy to calculate that sort of thing whenever it's a hundred laps. <laughs> that lap was at twenty six point two. Right there. A chance. That lap time was 26.4. Looks like I might be pushing him a little harder, trying to keep up, keep up front. Kind of looks that way. Still going very easy though. See, I'm entering much slower. That'll help that right front. Just gonna look. Weren't there yet, though. See if we can make them uh, overdrive. That was a uh, 26.5. Time was twenty six point three. I'm worried about my right rear as well. I don't want to kill the right rear. I want to be on that more than my right front, but if I get too loose, that'll also be a problem. So I'm trying not to slam the throttle so much out of the corner either. Pushes up a little bit there. Still not quite enough to get to his inside. Oh, the screen flashes. That's not what I want to see right now. Kind of close to the sky. Don't really want to lose sight of him even for a nanosecond. Might have to get around him soon. That three's coming back a little bit. The lap time was at 26.6. Set something up, maybe. Uh. 
He's doing a little bit better on speed now, or else, uh, or maybe I've just plateaued to the same speed. Back there. Caution were to come out now, I think we would definitely uh, have to pit. Not just, uh, in a place where I feel like I can pass necessarily. I'm catching him like mid corner, which is kind of a weird place to catch him. I can't really get around him at that point in the corner. He's here now. Hoping the three doesn't just dive in on me. Dive it in on me. I could I could have done that to the two like twenty laps ago, but I don't want to try to. I don't want to make that risk. I don't want to pass that way. If I don't have to. Being tough to pass. This gotta be it. Car outside, clear up top. Ah, I thought that was it, man. Just cannot get the run out of the corner. I still feel like I've got much better tires. It's just I can't get the run I need to get alongside him. And there's a caution. So let's move. Race cars out. Line up single file. Car two. Car zero. Two. We think well, that sucks. Gone off. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. Oh well, we'll take our tires and be on an equal playing field again. Pit road open. Full course yellow. Pits are open. Lane speed limit is 35 miles per right. hour. Okay, Colton, we'll fuel you to the end of the race. The lead car's pitting. So he qualified ahead of us, so we don't have to worry about him pitting before me. We got people staying out. 10. Oh, yikes. 5, 3, 2, 1. Right here. 88, 89. Share that. See uh, if anyone else does. Get an idea of what they're up to. Oh, 
clear. too tired, Target. probably, man. Ooh, don't speed. I lingered a little bit. Too long. Uh, above uh, 35. Cut it a little close. Oh, boy. Definitely got some guys that have stayed out. They might have taken tires early and really just need to keep a set, so understandable why, but still quite scary. Should be fine on fuel now. The leader, Kozak, is pitting. 94, 92. Pits are open. Huh. I must be doing something wrong. That's crazy. I felt like I had so much better tires. Maybe I'm just pushing harder than I need to. That's very surprising. So, thankfully we'll have uh, some guys on the inside as lap cars, I think. So we've actually only got one person on old tires, I believe. No, they're on two tires. Okay. Okay. So we're fine. Those guys are lap cars. One guy's on two tires. And two tires aren't so bad in this car. Just hopefully he doesn't get loose on us. And a spin directly in front of us. That would be very bad. I guess we have to do we have to try out first gear, huh? One left to green. Yeah. Up on the outside. It was such a good by. jump for him last time. I think we'll have to try it here. It's a quick shift, but I guess the difference that you get on launch is big enough. Does that 13... no... What are they doing? Why are they too wide up there? Why are the lap cars too wide up there? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Interesting. Well, uh, I don't know what this means. I guess whoever's on the outside has decided they're controlling the field. That's weird. That's truly bizarre. Okay, well, it is what it is, I guess. What is happening? He's diving down on the inside. That is terrifying. Oh. Never know what quite to expect here. Shoot past the seven here. Not quite didn't get to his inside. Lock at the bottom. Lift for him. Blocking the bottom, it's so annoying. Still there. Fastest lap for Smith. Still there. Hold your line. Was the next car is the leader. The guy behind has just done it. Twenty-five point three. Go low. Go low. Went so hard on his old tires. I know it's two tires in the legend, but still. There is a car on the high side. It's just killing both of our tires by making us do side by side right now. B2. Stay 
pinching me really hard. <laughs> this is frustrating. P3. Clear up top, outside. Still there. Still there, hold your I don't eye. understand what his plan is here. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Keep low. Jesus, man. Clear up top, car outside. You're halfway home, your fuel is fine. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. I just want to do single file so we can save tires again. Keep low. Keep low. We're halfway in the race. This Clear is up so top. annoying. Car outside. I guess he Still just cut me off. Clear high. Outside. Clear. Car outside. Clear outside. Inside. Man. Clear. Sticking noses. The yellow flag is out. Line up. Single file. Another wreck. Looks like another it's handful closed. of people are caught in it too. Sorry about that, man. That was probably my fault. Seven. Car. Well, like, we've basically killed our tires already, I think, having to fight alongside the 7. Just the most frustrating thing ever. Pit road's open. Pits are open. I think I just have to go for it one corner and just kill my tires. That way, at least I can get around them then. You need to understand why people like this track so much. At least we'll have a chance to cool them down a little bit. I'm just going to have to try to overtake him early this run. I really don't want to deal with him in front of me or alongside with alongside me anymore. He's doing what he needs to do with his current strategy. Like he needs to hold as many people off as possible until the tires even out. And uh, he's doing exactly that so far. Much to my disdain. Come on through here Mr. Bauer. Letter 13, We're just gonna have to try to find a way around as quick as quickly as possible. Try to get a quick run. What lap you on? What's the uh, lead lap? Coming to 56 at the line. Stop, yeah. Four Thank you. Yellow. Pits are open. Hopefully a less weird restart this time. The weird two wide lap cars. I don't know if someone just wasn't reading or if there was another scoring glitch, which iRacing has been very fond of doing lately, feels like. I'm sure it's not any more than normal, but it kind of feels like it. Should be good on fuel. Looks that way. Yeah, that's right. We came in and we topped off. We're, we're plenty good there. Feels like these pace laps are taking forever. 
one to green pretty soon here though at least. Four course yellow, pits are open. Probably just because we're pacing so slowly, it's what, like 45 is the pace speed? That feels like so unbelievably slow. One to go. Okay. Nick it's like the uh, pit road speed at 35, also super slow. I don't know, is the two still saving fuel or something? Taking the low line down there? No. It's weird. It's 18. Is he gonna be on the inside? Looks like it. Alright, everything checks out there. I believe we'll get a good view of him. The lead there. About to go green. Stay focused. Post car is off. Oh my god. What the hell? The sun just ran into the back of him. What was that? Just ran over the leader. Isn't even going yet. Going for the mega run. Is he really blocking inside. the inside? Or? Okay, he's fine. Clear inside. He's letting me go, I guess. Or maybe he saw I was dead serious. Or maybe he feels bad about how that started. I don't know. Two gets to take a look at the ground before he launches for the start there. Oddly enough, you're back in second, 25.5. Sure. Guess that uh, we're all lucky he didn't turn him, and then had a really weird situation on the restart. The tires do not feel good, by the way. Riding side by side that whole first little run, not good, not good at all. Seems okay though, I don't think that damage hurt him. Seven. Let me buy. Not sure if it's because he's got damage hurting him or if he uh, just knew I was gonna go for it really hard. I was like, you know what, just go ahead. I have no idea what, he, uh, what the th thought process was there, but he definitely just went ahead and let me go. That lap was at 26.1. I'll try to pass and I, think I just gotta do it with how tough it was later in the run. I just gotta go for it. That lap time was 26.1 really not falling for the whole go a lane down and act like you're going to dive it in. That's for sure.
Uh, not able to get a run. I really think he's just running to whatever pace he needs to to stay in front of me, to be honest. It really feels like he speeds up and slows down as necessary. He's just messing around, man. I mean, I think that's what he's got to do. I think that's a good plan. Answered that way too hard. Evans back. That was at twenty six point five. Brought friends too. Just get up right behind him, but I can't get around him. That's been the whole story. Now I'm trying different things and they're just making me worse. I think even trying to set something up also killed my tires. I went so bad to the tires this whole run. Well, what about something to drive, Ryan? I guess we'll just ride a little bit, and maybe let the tires cool down after all of my nonsense, trying to get all around them and stuff. See? Get right up on them again. But to what end? Nothing. Nothing to show for it. Oh man, I got nothing. It was four car coming now. Looking pretty fast. Probably saved his tires the whole run. Unlike me. And heck, maybe he can catch the two and make him use his tires some more. He'll get alongside me, I'm sure, and I'll, I, I won't fight him much. The car inside. Still there. Still inside. Clear. P3. That last light was a. Four's on the move. Let's see what he's got for the two, I guess. Tires are killed for me though. Just been terrible to them the whole run. And it's really showing. That lap was at 26.7. Around. 
little worried. He's not going to be able to do it right, though. He made me worried after running into the back of the leader on the restart. That he might not be able to get it done without running me over. He's not there, but he's going to dive in. So I can't block that off. Clear. Just gotta know when someone's gonna do something aggressive. P4, the gap to Carlson ahead is now 0.2. Car is so garbage right now. That lap was a 26.8. Good consistency. Keep them coming. Lucky if I can finish a top five at this point. Maybe the way to pass someone is to not try. To save tires better than they do and then you can pass them. Maybe that's what I'm learning here. Or it's reached the leader. Could get interesting. I hit the apron. Car inside. Oh. Still there, hold your line. Clear inside. <sighs> that sucks. I, just, I had to hold that low line with the 7 on my outside and I, I killed my tires. He probably had extra turn Inside. in it because he had the two tire call. Looser race car. Maybe I should have done two tires just because of that. I don't know. Like I said, though, we'll be lucky to keep the top five at this point. Slow car, download. Oh, jeez. Go high. How is that not a crash? Okay, thank you. Line up, single file. I was going to say. He's closed right now, past the paid car. Catch about three. Car. We think that Kozak has gone off. Pace car is out. Line up single file behind car number. This is zero. a two tire Three. call situation. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. If I ever did see one. Make sure we get caught up. Road's open. Pits are open. I feel like a lot of guys are probably going to take the two tires. The leader is so I'm probably not even going to gain speed. anything out of it, but I won't lose anything, at least, I hope. Boxing, 10, 5, 3, 2, 1, right here. All right, good stop. Let's go. 75, 86, just terrible. Just so terrible on the right front that time. Go, go, go! Drive smart. There are no more right side tires to put on. They want you in single file. He passed the three. Did he three, speed? Go. How did I get speeding? Oh, he got caught speeding. That sucks. Trying to beat me out, I think. Looks like uh, just about everybody up here. 
Two. Took two tires. Is the nine out of tires? Oh boy. Pits are open. Oh boy. This could get ugly. I hope he's at least smart about it. Knowing that we're gonna be much, much faster. Do a first gear start, I think. But we're gonna have to be very careful. Two tires. Hopefully we can hold on to it for the rest of the time at least. So the nine's gonna hope for immediate caution, I guess. I assume he's out of tires, and that's why he couldn't take any. And uh, with no green-white checkers, it, it could work out for him, but you kind of hope it doesn't, because it means there's been course, it would have to be multiple right. wrecks. Could get weird. One left to green. Really Line sucks for the three. three. Speeding there. Just the worst time for that to happen to him. Nine warming his old tires, I guess. try this first gear I guess I hope that eight's not trying to jump the start because he's pretty far back right now that always makes me nervous when I see someone that far back do not like the idea of that he's kind of closed up a little bit though let's not do what the uh, other guy did and run in the back of the two Pipe carries off. Let's see. Green flag. flag. You're back in fourth. We're position. gonna bad job. Car outside. Default. Clear outside if you want it. Outside. Didn't like that. Clear outside. Lock. I think that two just did. Outside is clear. <laughs> it's fine. We back out of it. Gonna be hyper aggressive, I guess. Clear. Two's gonna nearly spin. Outside. Go low. Ten to go. This time by. Go low. Smith is now leading. Go low. There is a car on the high side. Back on the bottom as usual. This guy's flying by up high. Outside, the next car the leader. P6. And they're crashing. Go, 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 past Caution. nine. Oh, are you kidding me? I was ahead of it. I, I know for a fact I was ahead of it. It must be a scoring thing. That's annoying. Race isn't over, I think. But that was just terrible for us. Hi, bad man. They need to stop wrecking. Oh, that just that couldn't have gone much worse for us. It's constantly getting stuck behind people, and I don't know if it was an intentional block by the two when I made it three wide. I didn't really have a choice. He was 
hitting the brakes so we didn't get a black flag on the restart. Not really in a position in this time of the race to be braking on a restart. You just really do not want to be caught on that inside, I don't think. We were so bad the 9 is still in front of us. I mean, we thought we got past him, but not quite, I guess. Hmm. I still don't even know about first gear. It doesn't even feel like it's much better. But I saw it firsthand, it really worked. For the two. You just get stuck on that inside and you have to slow down so much so that way you don't slide up into the guy and you're outside. And then they just start going past you like flowing river, man. That's terrible. I guess I'm just going to have to really try to be on the outside. Which is so counterintuitive, but I, I don't know. Are open. It must... I, maybe it works better. I don't know. So many pace laps, though. Hopefully we can at least go green to the end now. Because I think one more and it's over. We're already going to have not too many laps left. I think it's going to be a three lap race to the end, maybe four. I think it's four. Uh, too much time pacing though, but not too unexpected single split late night race. And uh, this car can sometimes, the races can sometimes be that way too. really happy with my performance here today though. I did so terrible on tires that second run. That re whole restart was just a chain of bad decisions I think. It's all open. Things that just did not work out. I don't know. We're still in a, a pretty good spot though. I gotta remember that. We're still sixth place. That's not terrible. And if we get any green laps at all, I feel like we should at least be able to pass the nine. Right, His Colton, tires are very old. Regime at the end of this lap. Five laps to go. Maybe get into that top five again. I wonder what happened on that restart with the four, where he was like so slow. Maybe uh, maybe he did a second gear start and it was really that different. I have no idea. Maybe he just uh, didn't jump as quick. Really got all bunched up, having to the two having to check up for that, and then me checking up because I didn't have any room when I tried to go to the inside. But here we go. About to go, there we go. Stay focused. Four's leading us off. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Oh, Hang on, we're not going green. Not going green. Hang on, we're not going what green. Not going green. What is this guy doing? Green. Let the no car by. You had the position when the yellow oh. flag came out. Let the pace car by. That was a great restart, guys. One to go. Next time, by. Get ready. Race the regime at the end of what this lap. What on line. earth was that? That was my fault. I missed the half shift, and then whoever was behind me had nowhere to go. Pace car Hit is me. out. Line up single file. And then it was impossible to get in a shift. Nine. I don't know why. Oh, sorry, guys. One of the guys back there just didn't hit the brakes. Wait, not a pace car here, guys.
Hang on, we're not going green. Not going yeah, green. It's right. Hang what a on, terrible we're not ending going green. Race. Not going green. Catch the pace car. Letter seven, carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Letter nine, oh, carbide. Nine. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Just a terrible restart, man. Well, good one, Nathan. Is it over now? Are you kidding me? How do you get your spot back? That's what I want to know. I don't know. If it's delayed green, we might get one to green here. Am I wrong? One left to green. Yeah, we're still going. Okay, no, you're Carlton, not. get ready. Race will resume at the end of this lap. Oh, maybe we can have a better restart this time, huh? Yeah, I won't miss a shift this time. <laughs> Got another shot at it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Don't run me over, Cole. I'm all tires here. Yeah, I gotcha. Hopefully, hopefully this goes well for all of us. Uh, my hopes aren't too high, though. <sighs> okay. Well, let's try it again. About to go green. Stay focused. The pace car is in. Floor is going. Green, green, green. Green. Let's go. Two to go. It's a natural You've green white check here. Two laps remaining. It'll be enough to get past the nine, I hope. Still there. White flag, one more lap. Still there. Push, push, push. We can get this position. All right. Clear high. Good there. Well, at least be able to crawl back to a top five, I guess. Big win, Nathan. Yeah, there we go. Good race, good win. Chicken flag, chicken flag, flag. Good job. Very good job. So at least we finish under green. That's what I was hoping for. Still not too thrilled with my performance, but I'll take it. Look out for the pit speed limit. And uh, bring it into the pits because we can. So, top five, though. Well, considering I had to change my strategy three times, I guess I'll take a top six. Yeah, that actually worked, worked out for them pretty darn well, uh, being on no tires in front of the field like that. Having that caution pretty quick really helped out, I think. Man, I just kind of fell apart the second half of the race, I think. Just uh, on saving tires and... Just uh, being in the wrong place at the wrong time too often. I don't know. I'll take it, though. Top five is always good. Even as the number one. I'll always take it. So, we'll see what happened out here. Lap three, we've got the 19 getting loose, finding the inside wall. Very common wreck to see here at Dover. Another common thing to see here is wall hits. We're just going to have to skip by a lot of those, I think, because we're going to see plenty of them, especially with two wide guys. Yeah, that car's not turning. Ooh, and this will bring out your first first caution, it looks like. The 8 and 18 find each other. You can see the 18 just bounces off the wall and uh, all the way down the track. Hey, the, the 8 did okay, though. He, was, uh, he still finished really well, didn't he? Yeah, you finished fourth. Wow, okay. You got pummeled, too. This 
car's still okay, huh? Yeah, well, good for him. I don't think the 16's car is okay, though. 19 all on his own. Finding the wall really hard. Crashing. Keeping it the right direction, though. Car is destroyed. Is he stopping on track? Did this bring out a caution? No, I don't think so. 18 leaving the pits and immediately spinning. That didn't turn out so well for him. I think that's going to be a wall hit, so we'll skip ahead a little bit. Junior Mints in the wall. Moving right along. Too wide here. 12 just gets tight on exit right up into the 13. <laughs> They're just going to go around the whole track like this, huh? How long can this last? Wow, okay. That was like a year and a half. <laughs> that was kind of weird. And then uh, they're going to find each other again, I guess. I, I, I don't know. That looked intentional. I don't think it was, though. I think he just drifts up into him. I don't know. He just didn't break enough, I guess, for the corner. Yeah, this car's real tight. I'm sure the 13's kind of sick of his antics, though. Oh, the 20 up into the 11. That's the 11, right? It looks like a, an 11. Broken car for the 20. He apologized. I remember hearing that. Honest mistake. I'm sure he caught him much faster than he expected. A restart here. I don't know why we're seeing this. I don't think anything's happening. 12 having himself a race. He's found that wall about a dozen times. Seventeen, all the way up into the wall. Really not a place to stick your nose anyway. That's just asking for trouble, sticking your nose on the outside, on the exit of a corner at Dover. Especially in this car. Like, that person's not going to be able to turn down at the last second. So, Junior Mints, in the wreck there. Teen up into the wall. Why we're seeing that. This is the immediate wreck. So let's see here. Still green. Still green. I'm trying to see the lights, but it's hard to see from any of these angles. Yellow, right now. Okay, so, knowing that, it just turned yellow. Look how far ahead I am of the 9. Look how long and far ahead of the 9 I was. Darn you scoring loops. Man, I, I intentionally saw them wrecking and gunned it up. I thought I was being a genius, because that was a not a good time to be gunning it up like that. Like, I was going to have to lift off really hard and exit, but it wouldn't have mattered if the yellow came out. But... Scoring loop says the 9 was ahead of me, and uh, who knows what difference that would have made. I obviously had to use that last little couple of green laps um, to get around the 9. If I didn't have to do that, could I have worked on the next guy ahead? Who knows. Here's the botched restart. Oh, yeah, he just missed, uh, he just completely missed the uh, gears and stuff. Eight tried to cut down under him. Just didn't go at all. That could have been much worse. It didn't even count as a restart because uh, the green hadn't come out yet. So it just delayed the green, which allowed us to keep going. Oddly enough. 
And then I don't know what the 13's doing. He just does not realize that the yellow's out, I guess, or that it's delayed. Just didn't know what was going on. He thinks he's being, like, smartest guy ever, like, coming around, smacking the wall. Weird situation, though, so can't really blame him for not really uh, knowing exactly what was happening in the moment. And the, tw the 12 having one last issue for the end of this thing on the final lap. Just a rough race. And then the three. I guess we can be thankful that we didn't speed. He was right up there in the front, and then he ends up with ninth. And uh, even spinning the 21 afterward. Oops. And uh, that was the last thing to see, so... Uh, I feel like I could have done so much better. Top 5 is still nice, but I feel like I uh, I really could have done better in a lot of ways, so... That's kind of disappointing, but... End of the day, 0x. We avoided uh, a lot of trouble. <laughs> There's a lot of issues out here. So, I'll take it for what it is. And that is a decent finish. And an estimated loss of 9 I rating. So That'll do it for this one. Um, I will actually remember to show the race results this time. I'm trying to remember so that way I uh, don't have to add it in post. So bringing up the page here and now switching on OBS over to the window capture. There we go. See, I'm getting faster at that. Figured this stuff out. Here you go, the four car, the winner. With the fastest lap, in fact. We'll get five, uh, fifth place. And actually, got a negative eight I rating. So not as bad. <laughs> Who cares, anyway. But <laughs> just uh, looking at the facts. Um, where did Chad... Uh-oh. Chad, there he is. He must have gotten into something. I didn't really notice which car he was, but he uh, must have gotten into some of that trouble because uh, he got a 4X there. And uh, he was more up here around us for most of that, so that's too bad. But uh, there's your finishing results. Thank you for watching. Exactly, 2,000 strength of field. That's interesting. Thank you for watching. <laughs> That'll do it, and I will see you next time.